Yes, they're all dancing. They're all dancing. Look at the dancing animatronics. Look at them. This is not at all weird and creepy. Yes, look at all the money. <gasps> look at all the money! Welcome back to The Sims 4, Freddy Fazbear's P- Oh my god, why does somebody always ruin my intro? Like I was saying, welcome back to The Sims 4, Freddy- Oh my god! <laughs> what is going on? Like I was saying, welcome back to The Sims 4, Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria Simulator. My goodness. AKA, let's try not to go broke challenge. Actually, the past like two episodes, we've been doing okay with money with the restaurant, especially since we planted all of these, which we will be getting a ton of money from soon. Last episode, Helpy got up close and personal with Natalie finally. Look very flirty. And I think, I think, we're gonna have Helpy marry Natalie because he loves her neck. He loves her neck so much. And what would be more romantic than having the wedding at the place that they met? Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria. So I think we have enough business funds for an arch. Oh my God, we have to get married right in front of the trash gang. Yes. I mean, we gotta get engaged first, so let's open for business, because we need some money for our wedding anyway. Welcome, Scrap Baby. And we got Spring Trap and Natalie, yes. Crap, I don't think- Oh, I can't have, like, regular interactions with her while she's working. That's okay, we'll just do a shift first. Alright, now, disallow already and just make sure everybody gets served that got sat everybody the four people that got sat before i made people stop coming in uh what's going on guys why is it taking so long there we go cool serve them oh my god did he just drop it forget it we're closing <laughs> i'm too anxious we we lost 200 dollars. it's fine <laughs> it's fine i just need to i need to do something important with natalie talk about dreams <laughs> And then, and then we should chat here in front of this conveniently placed arch. Somebody pick this up. It's ruining the atmosphere. Right in front of the tra trash in the gang, yes. Talking about my dreams. I'm like, you know, Natalie, I started this restaurant from the ground up. And she's like, I know. I know I admire that about you. Wait, are we even dating? Ooh, propose! Yeah, let's do it. Let's do it right away. No waiting. Yes. 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 Natalie, say yeah. Yes. Yes. Oh, yes. Oh, our children are gonna be so weird looking. I love your neck. Yes. Oh, she's so much bigger than him. <laughs> okay, well, let's get married right now. Plan a social event. You do not have enough money to start this social event. What? Oh, because it's all done. We're going to have to borrow from the uh, restaurant funds because I only have $7 to my name. There we go. Okay, wedding. I uh, guess. Sure, we'll just invite all these random people. Caterer will be Molten Freddy. Sure. It's going to happen here, of course. Oh. Oh, Natalie, no. No, no, no. First of all, why are you wearing a black dress? This is a happy day. You're not going to a funeral. You're marrying Helpy, the greatest bear ever. Also, you know I don't like looking at your regular face. You always need to wear your work outfit. How I like you the best, okay? And oh my god, I look weird too. Whoa, whoa, we need to fix this. Yes, thank you. I'm so turned on. Okay, now I gotta go back in my regular outfit. Okay, there we go. Okay, all is well. Wait, what do you mean? Why don't you like Natalie? You're supposed to be marrying her. Hey, go get married. Thank a guest for coming. Ask to leave profess undying love well i mean we're getting married she doesn't like me either wow this marriage is off to a great start oh my god i'm so short Ugh, happy frog put your outfit back on hey molten freddy what are you cooking for the wedding mac and cheese oh my god <laughs> he's making mac and cheese for our wedding that is the perfect wedding meal look look how happy he is all right, let's go do this thing. Natalie, why are you taking out garbage? It is your wedding day. And now you're complaining about it. Great. Go get married. You are the sunshine of my life. The angel that has fallen from heaven for me, Helpy. And yes, we are <laughs> Bucket Bob is officiating. <laughs> this is the most romantic wedding I have ever seen in my life. Bucket Bob, you are doing fantastic. What the <laughs> Molt Freddy, is that a plate of bread you're bringing into the bathroom? Fa fantastic. Fantastic. Are people watching? People should be watching this. Okay, here we go. Yes, yes, yes. And they're all like, <laughs> why is this wedding so weird? They're like showing the world how much they love each other. And the, the guests are just boogieing. They're just boogieing. Who are these random people? The only one I know is Scrap Baby. Oh, this is so cute. 
it. Oh, yes. Oh, my God. They're actually kissing. He's not on her neck. Oh, now he's on her neck. <laughs> now he's got her neck. Yay! We did it! Um, We gotta thank guests for coming. Thank for coming. Th thank for coming. Oh, where's everybody going? Thanks for coming. Where did? Why did everybody go outside? What is going on? <laughs> what is going on? Um... What is this? <laughs> is this the catering? Grab a serving. What is this? BLT. What happened to the mac and cheese? Uh, also, I'm very curious what Molten Freddy did with that plate of bread. Oh my god. This wedding is a disaster. What is this? Somebody come fix oh, this. Repair. What? Why are you all eating in the bathroom? Why is this oh man eating in the corner like he's ashamed? Okay. This is supposed to be a beautiful ceremony wedding day. Take the first slice. Uh, nobody made us a cake, so... Oh, are we supposed to do that ourselves? Was that not included in our package? You have insufficient funds. Crap, hold on. All right, hope he's gonna make his own wedding cake. Also, we're gonna have to upgrade our bed for a married couple. What's the cheapest one we got? This one. Can we make this a ton a bit bigger? Oh, so much money. All right, at least we can fit a bed in here. Hey, Natalie, I know our wedding's going on, but uh, I think we should have a baby immediately. Yes, it's gonna be half bear, half chicken thing. The most beautiful animatronic ever created. Are you guys going to create another animatronic? What are you doing? Is it because there's too many people here? Nope, that doesn't seem to bother them. They're bringing food to bed. Natalie, no, you need to keep your cup. <laughs> They're bringing the food in. Why is this so weird? Oh God, what's going on now? What happened? What happened? What happened? What happened? Is it because you guys are trying to finish eating? No, just bring it in. Just bring it in. Oh, it's because Molten Freddy's here. Get out of here. It's our wedding night. We're gonna... Uh, like, get out of here, Molten Freddy. Let's go, sorry. Oh, yeah. Animatronic mate. What? What? What just happened? Oh, is it... Is it because there's no real doors? Like, what? what? Hold on. I'm getting rid of these doors. And this wedding arch. Monies. All right, come on. We need a new animatronic baby. Do this. You guys really don't want to give up your food, huh? What is going on? Is it because there's an event going on? Everybody get out of here. Oh, whoa. Oh, oh no. Oh, no. I think I had Natalie live with us. Oh, no. Wait, no. I don't want her to live with us. We're going to have an unconventional marriage. You know, because we're already unconventional. We're robots. All right. Now can we make another animatronic character, please? Let's try this again. They finally put their food down. Okay, let's see. Yes, it's finally happening. Healthy and Natalie. Natalie and healthy. Yes. All the guests are gone. There's garbage everywhere. Somebody needs to fix the fridge. Wait, can I not repair it? No. I can't replace it yet. Yes, I can. Jeez, we're just spending money left and right. Place, fine. Here, there you go. Natalie! How am I supposed to know if you're pregnant, though? Because I can't control you. Uh, I don't know if she's pregnant. Hmm? Bite to stay the night. Try for baby. Let's just keep we'll keep doing it. We're married now. A sleepover? Sounds great. You guys are married. So I think the fridge just friggin' broke again. Wow. You can finish eating your sandwich now, healthy, if you want. Pick patch what you want. <laughs> you guys are all just gonna hang out when Natalie's trying to sleep. How am I supposed to know oh, if we're having a baby? Look at healthy stuff right now. First kiss, first woohoo, just married, engaged. He had a very, very eventful two episodes. Hey Natalie. I hope you're not too tired because even though it's two in the morning, the night of your wedding, we are gonna be open for business. Get up, Natalie. Yes, get up, Natalie. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Manage Natalie. Praise Natalie for coming in on her wedding night to work. <laughs> Give inspirational speech about why it's important to come into work on your wedding night. Ooh, try for baby. We could try for baby during work hours. Oh no. Oh no. I'm like, can you please take a break? We need to, uh, we need to make another animatronic. Ah, she won't leave. What a good employee. You cannot do this while vampires is breaking in. Who is breaking in? Is it this dude with the weird one Squidward flipper? Who's the vampire that's breaking in? These are all paying customers. That's not a vampire. Oh, no, that's a paying customer. Where's the vampire? Who's the vampire? Hmm. This guy looks sketchy. Hey, Mr. Hippo, you want to be a bodyguard? Come intimidate this guy. You're going to be Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria Simulator's uh, bouncer. It is necessary. Oh, 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 no. Oh, no, this is not at all what I wanted you to do. Oh, no. Oh, everybody's watching. Everybody's watching. Oh, God. Oh, you, oh, oh, you knocked him out. Oh, oh, there's people crying. Oh, God. Oh, no. Uh, everybody's crying. Mr. Hippo. I said to intimidate the guy. I, that wasn't even the vampire. <laughs> 
Wait, Mr. has done some offending acts in front of other Sims. Sims who witness Mr.'s offending acts might curse at him or punch him when they see him. Oh my god. Um, Mr. Hippo, please go into the back where it is safe. Thank you. I thought it, I thought he was I thought he was a vampire. I thought I thought he was a vampire. I'm sorry, I thought he was a vampire. My bad. My bad, guys. I thought I thought he was breaking in here. Sir, would you like free I will give you something for free. He's still gonna eat here. <laughs> oh wait, he's leaving. Never mind. <laughs> Never mind. I was about to give you free food, but now I don't have to. Mr. Hippo! Oh my god. This is, that's probably why you should not have animatronics. Be bouncers. They just go they get out of control. Five star rating. Nice. Is it cause we pretty much had a fight club in here? Was that exciting for everybody? Um, there's another ridiculous part of this mod that I kind of want to try. <laughs> okay, Happy Frog is gonna dance for money. Happy Frog, dance for money. Dance for money. Happy Frog, dance for money. Oh, you're in like a frog pose. I like it. Spring trap, no. Spring trap, no. You're working. Oh god, everybody's coming. Everybody's coming. Oh, money, money, money. This series is getting ridiculous. Money, money. Do your frog pose. Yes. Happy Frog. Everybody loves when Happy Frog dances. Everybody loves when Happy Frog shakes the booty. She's in her frog pose. Oh, yeah. Yes, monies. 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 I like how nobody's offended by this. They're all like, yeah, this is totally cool. I'm just gonna give you money. See, we have dancing animatronics. All of you animatronics, dance. Dance for money. Mr. Hippo, dance. Dance. Yes. Yes, they're all dancing. They're all dancing. Look at the dancing animatronics. Look at them. This is not at all weird and creepy. Yes, look at all the money. <gasps> look at all the money. Oh, no. I mean, they're not stripping. They're just doing weird booty dances. Um, thanks for all the money, guys. Thanks. I like how Natalie is so unfazed by everything. She's just like, you know, this is my wedding night. I might be pregnant. Life's not going great. All right, you guys can stop. Do I have to make you stop? Stop twerking for money. Stop, stop dancing for money. Don't, don't have to do this anymore. Clear up reputation on social media. Yeah, yeah, Mr. Hippo, do some PR damage, all right? People are yelling at you. No, clear clear your name on social media. Just say, you know, you thought that guy was a danger and a threat. You were mistaken. What the heck was that? Are people like you now? Reputation. Oh, his reputation went down by five points. Cool. Mr. Hippo successfully cleared up his bad reputation and lost five negative points. Sweet. Good job, Mr. Hippo. Now don't beat up anybody. You can intimidate them, but you can't punch them, okay? Unless they're actually being violent. How much money do we? We got so much freaking money. <laughs> Good. We made back our money from the wedding. I don't know why I'm clapping in real life. <laughs> ridiculous. There we go. We're replenishing, uh, wait, where'd the money go? Oh, oh, I did it the wrong way. Yay, we're replenishing our money from the wedding. Oh, Pigpatch, you're singing for everybody good. Ooh, there's a steal money interaction. Mr. Hippo! Don't do it to our customers, though. They need that money to pay. Can we find a random person? We need more monies. I like how we tried to get money, we tried to earn money the right way for, like, what are we on, the 11th episode? 10th or 11th episode? And now, uh, we're becoming corrupt AF, beating people up, twerking for money, and now I'm trying to find somebody to steal from. All right, it's gonna have to be one of our customers. I can't find anybody else. This new customer. Let's steal money. All right, Mr. Hippo, just slyly. I'm praying. It's part of the extreme violence mod. I'm praying he doesn't punch the guy. I'm hoping he just like slips into his pocket and just like pickpockets him. Pr oh, 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 I didn't do anything. It wasn't me. Oh, ha <laughs> ha, he doesn't know how much money did I what we get? Did we even get anything? What if I just steal money from him again now that he's staring at me? Oh, uh, we did already. He doesn't even care. He's too rich to care. Can we steal money from the little girl? Steal money from a kid. Oh, yeah. Mr. Hippo's turn. <laughs> and then made it rain in front of her. Savage, Mr. Hippo. Exposed. Exposed. Attention to everyone. This man will attack you. Be careful when he's around. Hey, hey, hey. That is not very nice. That is not very nice, sir. Sir, our star rating has increased. Perfect. I think that's the last uh, thing I can use from that extreme violence mod without killing somebody. <laughs> I was just curious. Oh, no. These people have a one star. Why? Oh, God. Oh, they're leaving. Oh, they're leaving. What happened? Our restaurant is falling apart. I have achieved the love of my life, Natalie. And my business was doing so well before that, but apparently I've spent too much time on my romantic life. And now, now it's failing. We might have a baby on the way. Look how Mr. Hippo's hiding out in here because everybody wants to hurt him. Embarrassed. You should be embarrassed. You stole from a child and then made it rain in front of her. All right, let's uh, disallow new customers. This, this has been a ridiculous restaurant day. And just finish up with who we got. Yay, everybody's neutral at least. Nobody's, nobody's upset with their job. Job. <laughs> this guy, 
I wish this place had more friendly service. You mean people who didn't steal out of your pockets when you came into the restaurant? Yeah, that's fair. Oh my god, our fridge, our fridge. We gotta use that torque money to replace this. Actually, let's upgrade the friggin' fridge, because this thing breaks all the time. Sell it for scrap money. And get a let's upgrade our fridge. Hmm. We got enough twerk money in the bank. Yeah, look at that nice new fridge. Can we upgrade the counters too? Cause these are kinda meh. Ooh, this is, this is nice. Oh, whoops, I got rid of the microwave. Yeah, upgrade in the kitchen. This is your wedding gift, Natalie. <laughs> She's like, so you're not actually getting me like a proper wedding gift? No. You have a better work environment now, Natalie. That is your gift. Cause I know that's what you want most in this whole world. Uh, let's get a new microwave too, Natalie. Let's just splurge a little bit. There we go. There we go, Natalie. Even though you don't use any of this. It's, it's, it's still for you. It's all for you. Oh. She's like, could you please hire another chef? Like that would be fantastic. <laughs> Next episode. Next episode. Oh my God, I can steal money from him again. Do it, do it now, Mr. Hippo. <laughs> yes, yes, run away, run away. Mr. Hippo, run away, run away, run away before he notices. What's going on? Oh, oh, he's not even looking at me. Embarrassed. Did you still get to keep the money? Come water all the plants. Do something useful, Mr. Hippo. You keep getting caught stealing. You're the worst. This guy is like, I hate this place. I hate this place so much. I was robbed twice since I've been here and the only thing they served me was bread and coffee. This is a really weird, really weird establishment. All right, Natalie's tired. Can everybody finish eating, please? It's her wedding day. <laughs> Or it's the, the day after her wedding day. She worked all straight through the night because she's a trooper. But you guys got to finish eating and leaving so I can actually get her some rest because she might also be pregnant and probably shouldn't be on her feet all day. All day. All right, this is taking too long. Close. I bet you I lost money. <laughs> yep. Oh, no. Wow. We have served 276 customers. All right. Oh, my God. What? Our business funds are negative $95. Guys, how did this happen? Is it because I... Oh, is it because I re model the kitchen. I'm, just, I'm gonna get rid of the islands. <laughs> there we go. People are gonna have to twerk for money next shift. I'm sorry. That's just what's gonna happen. Everybody be ready to twerk tomorrow. When you come when you come back, you gotta be get ready to twerk. Natalie, wait. Not you though. Not you. Wait, Natalie, I wanna talk to you. Natalie, Natalie, it won't let me talk to her. It says I can tell a group story. What? All right, fine, Natalie. Go home, whatever. Be mischievous to Natalie. Why? Why? Poor Natalie. Oh, good. You watered them all. Good job, guys. Ooh, there's a random stranger. Mr. Hippo, steal his money. Steal his money. Oh, he's gone. Go back to harvesting. Give up your life of crime for a little bit. Come harvest all this. Beautiful. I can't believe... Oh, no. Oh, because I sold the islands. We have 400 and... Fifty-seven dollars and three hundred and seventy. Where did all of our money go? Uh, yeah, we gonna we gonna have to dance for money. We're gonna have to dance with our clothes on for money at our next uh our next opening. Ooh, somebody come steal from her. We need a little bit more money. Steal money. Hey, Helpy, it's me, Natalie. Do you want to go out on a date? No, <laughs> I'm married to you now, girl. You're stuck with me, regardless if I take you on dates or not. Where are you going, Happy Frog? Where'd you just go? Oh, oh, oh. I guess you got caught for stealing money. Oh well. <laughs> She's just a robot. I can't control her actions. Need to see if Natalie is pregnant. Natalie will be right over. She better be. I guess I can see if she's pregnant, if I can still try for a baby. Come on, Natalie. We need to make more animatronics. I need more bodies to twerk for me, okay? I don't care if they're my son or daughter. Money comes first, Ooh, Natalie. I know, I know I've changed since we've been married five hours ago. <laughs> Just keep trying for a baby. This is the longest trying to get pregnant ever. It still says we can try for a baby. No. <gasps> oh, oh, she's thinking about baby. Are you pregnant? Are you Pregnant? Try for baby and bush. <laughs> that sounds romantic AF. Let's go do that. Where are we going? If we conceive a baby in here, that's ridiculous. After all the other attempts. <laughs> what are you guys doing out here? This is terrible. Meanwhile, they're over here. Not that far away from them. You pregnant? 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 Where are you going? Oh, are you going to see if you're pregnant? You going to see if you're pregnant, Natalie? Please, 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 please. Oh, she left. I guess we're just gonna have to wait till next episode to find out if Natalie's pregnant or not. Why every time I look in the kitchen, Happy Frog is staring at the microwave. Happy Frog, what are you doing? Oh, she's actually making food. I just keep catching her staring in front of the microwave this whole episode. All right, guys, but I think that's gonna be it for this episode of Freddy Fazbear's Pizzeria Simulator. As you can see from uh, what I did in this episode, I'm running out of ideas. I mean, I have the idea for what's gonna happen in the end because I'm probably gonna be following the ending of the regular game. 
but I can't follow the ending and continue the series, if you know what I mean, because the ending is kind of all tying everything up and I can't really continue. So I'm trying to decide how many episodes I should make this series. I don't think I'll be doing the full 20, but we'll see. If you guys can throw some awesome ideas at me to keep it going, you let me know. And uh, I think I'm just gonna keep trying to expand the restaurant, at least for the next couple episodes. If anything, maybe I'll try to round it out at episode 15, if we can tie it up nicely for, for that episode. But let me know what you guys think in the comments below. As always, if you made it this far in the video, make sure to leave a like before you go. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. I put out new videos every single day. And as always, I will see you guys soon. You guys better start practicing how to twerk for money. Is that, are you guys researching how to twerk for money? Good.